space speak. Subros, that's the other one that's doing very, very well. The company bagged an order. And also this positive news flow with regard to the cabin AC that will be mandatory uh, for CVs by October 2025. Sonia joins us to fill us in with more details. Sonia? Well, thanks a lot for that. You know, Subros is the only integrated manufacturing unit in India for auto uh, air conditioning systems, right? So it's very well placed to get a lot of fresh orders as well. The stock is up 12% today, but let's not forget the stock is up 70% in 2023 and many positive triggers for the company. Uh, it won an order worth 25 crores from the Indian Railways. It already supplies to the Indian Railways, but now the order win is for delivery and commissioning of air conditioners. Uh, the Road Transport Ministry has also made AC truck cabins mandatory from October of 2025, so that is an additional positive for Subros. Let's not forget that the earnings for Subros have been very strong in the quarter gone by. The revenue growth has been in excess of 17%. The profits are up 175% on a year-on-year -year basis. And the company, as we know, manufactures compressors, condensers, heat exchangers, uh, and is the only integrated manufacturing unit in India for auto air conditioning systems. So very well placed to gain more in terms of business. The stock is now um, you know, up almost 12.5% in trade. Back to you. Well, Subros, they're the top, among the top gainers, they're up 12%. I remember when this news had earlier come out in June, the stock had also rallied 20% back then as well on that news. Some flashes